This was all part of God's plan. It was not a surprise to Jesus. Jesus is God the Son. God is the creator of everything. Where does this circle start? We don't know where it starts. It's a reminder of God and his love for you. His love is everlasting. It has no beginning or ending. Jeremiah 31.3 says, I have loved you with an everlasting love. Before you were even born, God knew you and loved you. God made you and watches over you every moment. He knows you so well, he knows what you'll do each and every day of your life. God also knew that some of the things you would do would be against him and make him sad. We call those things sin. God is holy or perfect, and all sin is against him. The punishment you deserve for sin is separation from God's love, peace, and joy right now on earth, and ultimately forever in a place of punishment. This is not what God wants for you. He wants you to be with him forever instead of away from him. But God loves you and wants to bring you close to him. That's why he sent Jesus, God the Son, to earth to pay for your sins. Jesus never sinned, but he suffered, bled, and died on a cross for sinners like you and me so we can be forgiven. After Jesus died, he was buried. But on the third day, he came alive again. Today, he is alive in heaven, ruling as king. Jesus died for your sins to bring you to God. Have you believed or put your trust in him? John 3.15 says that whoever believes in him may have eternal life. To believe is to trust Jesus completely to take away your sin. If you trust Jesus as the only one who could pay for your sin, you will have eternal life, new life with God that starts now and lasts forever. God will forgive your sin and help you love him and live for him. Word up! Jesus forgives. This was all part of God's plan.